Okay, welcome back. We have picked up the number three level wristband as well as the power regulator thingamabob. So we're going to go back to the early parts of the nest lab and that'll give us access to an area we didn't uh, give us access to something we didn't have before. I know, it's exciting. I also feel I'm probably close enough to the end of this game that I don't have to conserve ammo anymore. I can just open up and start blasting shit. So that's good. Which means I'm gonna find what the hell it was I missed when I was going through this area before. You're dead, right? Yeah, you're dead. I stuck a knife in you and then I had to get back. Oh. Uh, more of these. And... Oh, you? Sorry. Muff. Alright. Oh, okay, you're not dead. Sweet. Oh, I didn't take your leg off. Oh no. Out of ammo. And okay, that got me that. It's certainly nice, but I was thinking that there was going to be Oh shit. <laughs> Bitch. She's fine. Certainly nice to have extra space, though, isn't it? Okay, I got level three. Level four gets me to the other side, but I believe level three can get me... Level four gets me into the elevator. Level three, here we are. He's gotta be dead, right? Do I wanna take that? <laughs> Oh, he's got something useful. Hmm, look at this place. OSS. work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time.
were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive! We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the samples, then. Let's move. Of course, that event in the original game was told as a flashback that Annette had relayed to Claire. So, it's a um, little bit of a different way of telling the same story, I guess. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna want to prep here. Uh, you know what, I can prep on the other side. That's right. There's gotta be something in here. Lockers everywhere. Ah, fuck it, moving on. Oh, I was wrong was something here. <laughs> what the hell is this room supposed to be? <laughs> wow, look at this shit they got in here. Another save room, that quick, huh? Alright, so I'm going to collect the last of the gunpowder, the herbs, and all that shit. And then I'm going to go and uh, make some ammo. Now, the I do have these uh, infinite ammo things here, but I'm not going to use them because I feel like it sort of spoils the uh, what the experience is supposed to be. I'm going to put away all my weapons. I'm gonna, the only thing I'm going to keep is the gunpowders. Then I'm going to use them to make our gunpowder and then make our guns and then if I have more left in the inventory after that then I'll make some more. So I'm only going to take the high grades and the larges for right now. Man, I have a lot. Oh, yeah, I, I, okay, I overkilled again. I was way too stingy on ammo beforehand. Ah, shit. Machine gun ammo. Fine, I'll take the machine gun, but I don't want that. What I really want... I mean, I'll make another machine gun just to have a stock of that, but uh, what I really want are the acid rounds. That's, that's right, right there, that's, these things are crazy useful. And, okay. Okay, what I've done is I've made a lot of ammunition for, uh, I've made a lot of ammunition for every gun that I still have. Still a few in there, but screw it, I'm not taking everything. I also... Oh man, I really wanted to take this. But I got that damn machine gun. Ah, fuck. Handgun ammo. Just max that out. No sense in not doing that. And, you know what, I'm... I'll have, I'll have some more opportunities in a few minutes. Antiviral agent. Gotta get back to Sherry. Sense. 
now. What the hell is this thing? That was my husband. I should have killed him while I had the chance. I don't know why, I just... I couldn't do it. He was your husband. Honestly, we were more married to our work than each other. But what about Sherry? How could you just leave her all alone and while Rackham City burned to hell? I couldn't let my daughter grow up in a world with the G-Virus in it. But that's no excuse <laughs> for... I think I my strategy needs to be altered a little bit. So I can hit him in the eyes. Hey, like that shit. Oh, I had to shoot the chest. Fucked that up, didn't I? Alright. And where's the other eye? Haha. <laughs> okay, on the back. Should be one in the arm. I'm out of ammo for that. Ah, she's still alright. And show me that arm.
Come on now. Come on. That was that. Now there's gonna be some sh shit down here. Uh, let's see if I can find any of it. Opened up some space in my inventory, that's nice. Okay, I was thinking this hat, there was something down here. I remember there being stuff down here. Ah, just what I need, pistol ammunition. It's always nice to have this shit, right? Man, was this stuff here during the battle? If it was, then what the hell was I doing? room for everything. Like I really needed all this pistol ammo though. Gotta get back to Sherry. Now that boss battle, I mean, it pretty strongly resembled the fight that we had against Birkin in the original game. Around about the, uh, as we were going down the tram ride, because the kind of mutations that he had were pretty, pretty intense by that point. And, you know, he was starting to look like real, like a friggin' monster. Ah, damn it. Don't. Oh, look, I have more herbs in here. I didn't realize I had them. Should I even have the pistol? I'll, I'll keep some of the ammo because the SLS-60 can use it. But, I mean, I'm carrying around needle cartridges and I don't even have the damn needle gun. Uh, I'm not even I'm not even going to take it. It's in here somewhere. So I'll get rid of that. And I have more uh, herbs I can combine. Yeah, that, I'm pretty well I'm pretty well decked out with weapons. But uh I'll continue this in the next episode, though, so thanks for watching.